What's up, Raph gang? It's Raph in the Raph cave. Welcome back to another video. This is an unboxing video of a four-way HDMI splitter. Now, for the Raph cave, I got a lot of devices. I got a lot of splitting going on. Uh, my primary splitter is the Philips Hue HDMI sync box. That's what uh, takes in the uh, 4K signal, 60, 60 frames a second, HDR, Dolby Vision, high-end audio, Dolby Atmos, all that good stuff. Goes into that box, and then it, it goes out, and I have a splitter. It's a four-way splitter, uh, but it's an older splitter. It does 4K, but it doesn't do HDR, and it doesn't do... Uh, high-end audio for some reason. So anyway, if right now it's a band-aid that way I can get um, You know gaming PC stuff to my projector uh, So if I want to have you know my stuff on my OLED right here And I want to see it on my Vizio right there And I want to go over to the projector and play something on the home theater I can do that with the splitter, but unfortunately I'm missing out on HDR and I'm missing out on high-res audio So I picked up a splitter well, first, you know, let me, I'll, I'll show you what's what's going on on my PlayStation. See right now, PlayStation that gives me, uh, you know, gives me 4K color format as you know YUV 420, uh, and then no HDR. Uh, HDCP is off, so I can do streaming, but HDR is off, and unfortunately, it's, it gives me a nice little message that says your TV doesn't support HDR. It's hooked up to a damn OLED. Oh my God, are you kidding me? That is gross. Um, so let's flip over to. Um, this screen here. So this is the splitter that I purchased. I'm going to give this a shot. It's 30 bucks on Amazon. You know, 30 bucks can't go wrong. It's, you know, it's definitely worth uh, the price if it works. Uh, I made sure that this one is 18 gigabits per second. I made sure it handles the high res audio, Dolby Atmos, DTS, HD, all good stuff. HTCP compatible all the way to 2.2, HDMI 2.0. And then it says uh, HDMI, uh, HDR is on the actual package itself. Right there, HDR, bottom right, 4K60, 4K HDR. Um, so yeah, this uh, mirrors, mirrors uh, four screens at the same time, 3D compatible. It checks off all the, uh, most of the color, gamma, or the chroma stuff. Doesn't do 444, I guess. 420 4k 60 hd audio so 111 is the edid switch that we want so all up i guess is what we want uh it's got a power cord it's got a reset key got some lights on there to tell you where the output it's going to pretty good there and uh yeah so it seems pretty pretty solid let's get this unboxed and uh plug it in and see if it uh does what it says it's going to do hopefully if not then the nice thing about amazon is you can return it. All right, guys, let's uh, unbox this here. Here is the box. High definition multimedia interface. Uh, okay. First thing you see is like this. All right, so we have the basic power adapter to USB and micro USB cable. Pretty standard stuff there. We got a nice uh, little thank you card here. And then the instruction manual with the uh, EDID codes on the back. Boom. And the main event. Nice solid Aluminum brick. It's got that nice uh, shiny engraved texture. Very nice. Four. One in, four out. Got the EDID switches. Got the lights in front. There's your front. And there's your back. And then it even gives you all the uh, EDID codes on the back. Very nice. All right, well, let's plug it in and uh, see if it any works and uh, see if the PlayStation accepts it. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and turn on the projector and see if I get 4K HDR on the projector. So uh, without further ado, guys, let's 
plug it in. So this was the old splitter I had made by Ori. It's a 4K 60 premium splitter, but uh, this was definitely not the new stuff. So now, there's the new splitter. We got input here, and then we have output. Not using that one. Output to projector and output to OLED. Lights are on. EDID is all the way up for 1111. All the lights are good. And now, through the Marantz. Now, there is one bummer. We're not getting uh, Dolby Audio or anything like that. It doesn't work. But that's okay because we do have HDR activated. All right, guys. As you can see, we are activated. We have HDR on the OLED, we have HDR on the projector, and we have HDR on my Vizio TV right next to me. As you can see on the screen here, boom. We are fully activated at 4K60 with HDR color format, HDR supported, and the various frequencies of HDR are good to go. So that is an absolute win. Very happy. Um, I have this uh, splitter, $30, and it definitely works with 4K60 and HDR. Not sure about the audio. It is what it is. Um, but hey, for $30, bucks, i am getting 4K60 and HDR. That's all I wanted. That was primary, number one focus, and it did it, and it delivered. So anyway, guys, if you're looking for a four-way splitter for HDR on the cheap, I will leave a link to this item in the description below. Go ahead and click that link. It helps me out at no cost to you. I appreciate it very much. Smash the like button on the video so it helps other people out. And I appreciate you guys for watching. You guys have a great day. Home Theater Rules. Raph out. See you guys.